Here is a bag of marbles with four black marbles, four stripy marbles and two white ones. Marbles are taken out of the bag one by one and not replaced. This is very important. Find the probability of getting two black marbles, two white marbles and in part C a white marble followed by a black marble. Since the marbles are taken out and not replaced, the denominator in the second fraction is going to change. This is because once you take a marble out, there will only be nine marbles left in the bag. So in part A, the probability of getting two black marbles. The probability of getting a black marble to start off with is four out of 10. After one of the black marbles are taken out, there are only three left in the bag. If there are only three left in the bag, it will now be three out of nine. Once again, these two fractions are multiplied together because of the AND rule. We're looking for a black marble and another black marble. In this question, we can cancel down the second and the first fraction. In the first, we divide by two to give us two fifths. In the second, we divide by three to give us one third. And now we can multiply the numbers together. 2 times 1 is 2 over 5 times 3 is 15. So the answer for part A is 2 out of 15. In part B, we want to know the probability of getting two white marbles. The probability of getting a white marble to start off with is 2 out of 10. Once one of the white marbles is gone, we only have one white marble left and nine altogether. So after getting a white marble out, we now only have one out of nine remaining. Once again, these two fractions are multiplied together. Here we can cancel down the first fraction by dividing by two to give us one fifth and then multiply across. So the final answer is one out of 45. In part C, when you read this very carefully, you can see that they've given us the order in which the probability occurs. First we get a white marble, and then we get a black one. The probability of getting a white marble to begin with is 2 out of 10, similarly to part B. Now once one of the white ones are taken out, there are 9 marbles left altogether, but still there are four black marbles in the bag. So here it is four out of nine for the probability of choosing a black one second. Once again, we can cancel. We can either cancel down the four and the 10 or the two and the 10. I'm going to divide the two and the 10 by two. Two divided by two is one. 10 divided by two is five. We cannot cancel down any further. So now we multiply across. 1 times 4 is 4, 5 times 9 is 45. This is your final answer.